blocks, truck, couple, God first, family second, then the money. God first, family second, then the money. Yeah. We took some L's but still prevailed, I'm blessed, I ain't stressed. A lot of signs you gotta peep on this road to success. Go. Got heavy eyes cause I don't sleep. I'm First time here, you guys. It's a family-owned restaurant, and we're gonna check it. Good. Never young people, man. Some of them get turning all around. Yeah, but yeah, but they need to be washing their hands. Maple man. Right. Don't make them mad. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Whether you eat it or not, you gotta I'll, I'll never give it back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't make them mad. They might come out and shoot you. <laughs> I know it's bad. You know what I'm saying? I ought to get them to get out. Yeah, 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 yeah. But their mental attitude yeah. is different, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. That's what I think they buried into it, man. Yeah. That's what I appreciate about family-owned businesses because the workers, they all family, so they care about the quality integrity, of the restaurant. Integrity, yeah, they got the integrity yeah. about themselves. They care about the people. You know? Right. Yeah. They know who people. Right, right. And they want the business to keep striving. Right? Yes. Yeah, we've been there. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Table, this is hot sauce, pepper sauce, and honey, salt and pepper, and then butter. It's up there, and you little trays in case you want everything separate or for your bones, okay? Okay. okay. You Try a little bit of everything. That's Brunswick stew, pulled pork, macaroni and cheese, steamed corn, butter beans, and chicken. And I didn't get the cold potatoes, but we're gonna see what we got. I'm a YouTuber, so if you see me talking to my phone. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try the blunt with stew first. Macaroni cheese tastes good. Yeah, you know you got it going on. You got salt and pepper. You know? Yeah, yeah. The mac and cheese is good. The mac and cheese is good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let that throw down. Taste, you know, too much. <laughs> the corn is good too. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna smack on this one. <laughs> These lima beans, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Green lima beans. Mm -hmm. I really got a good taste on it. Mm -hmm. Normally we be reaching for the salt and pepper. We ain't gotta do we that. We this time. salt and pepper this time. Mm -hmm. Maybe when they still come. So, maybe all of them. <laughs> They're really getting your heart. <laughs> you right, normally you reach for the salt and pepper. You don't have to do that. Pretty nice, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's always better to cook in there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Get a thumbs up, y'all.
And he got a to-go plate, y'all. <laughs> but it called me, though. <laughs> That's it all right. Me, he man. got a to-go plate. Man, it called me, man. Seven dollars. <laughs> Seven dollars. Let me show you what it got. What you got? Oh, chicken, pork, and peach cobbler. You can get... Man, that peach cobbler, man. It was good, wasn't it? Good. You can get what's... Since it's all you can eat, I'll tell you in the car. Was we not recording that whole time? You start over. So, since you have... Since it's all you can eat, in order... You can't take anything with you. You have to... Once you finish eating, you can get a to-go plate and fill your plate up. From basically. what's left on that turnaround, what yeah. you didn't eat. What's left on your table. Yeah. So he, he grabbed all the meats and the peach cobbler, but everything was really good. And what'd you say about the seasoning? You didn't have to season anything. Nothing. Uh, no salt, didn't put any salt on it, man. It tastes like grandma's chicken. Yeah, tastes like grandma's fried chicken. It was good. <laughs> It was a good batter. It wasn't like, uh, you know how you go to churches or Bojangles and they had a real hard, crisp, crispy batter? It was like a batter. That garbage. But it had a good flavor on the batter and it wasn't too crunchy, too crispy. It was really good. Like it was fried in a cast iron skillet. So anyway, somebody made the comment. Somebody made the comment on, on our, one of our videos that they like Walter but they couldn't sit across from him with all that smacking. But that, but that lady, but that lady, she showed me about that lady or uh, B Love's life. Wow, she she got like millions of views of just smacking. One video, 14 million views. I think I, I think I start smacking. Yeah, she uh, she was on CNN. <laughs> Because really? she became a millionaire from YouTube videos. That that's why they, they brought her on you CNN to highlight that. I wonder if she I wonder if she gained a lot of weight from doing all that. She's a uh, real short and petite. She says she has gained some weight. Her and her husband have started eating a lot healthier and they've lost a lot of weight from juicing. But she's very short and petite and she's had some plastic surgery. So but uh the latest video that I've seen from her, they just bought a big factory because she, she started making the sauce for her seafood bowls that you dip it in. And it's doing so well on Amazon that they just bought a big factory to start making the sauce they sell. Really? Yep. So, oh. we might be doing mukbangs, y'all. Hey, no, I ain't doing no mukbang, man. I ain't, I ain't doing no mukbang. <laughs> I might do a little smacking, but I ain't gonna do no mud bag because I can't I can't eat all that food like that. I'm too old to be out. Once a week, whatever I cook, we can do a mud bag. <sighs> can't do it like I can't eat all the food like that. That's true. Man, you see, I gained too much weight and you definitely just not gonna eat all that food like that. Because I just look at food and I can't. So you ain't gonna turn you let the one up, but you ain't gonna turn the air. I don't it's understand. Up. You gotta turn it up.
Hey. All right, I gotta go grab your other discharge instructions. I'll be right back. Okay then, thank you. He was first, I'm going next. I'm kind of scared, but man, don't go put me to sleep. And then that male nurse said, while I was asleep, I woke up and looked at him and told him, man, what you doing in my house? <laughs>